just hope you're well. Right, how to play the drum beat from To Cut A Long Story Short by Spandau Ballet. Shout out to channel member Gajon who asked about this one. It goes a bit like this. So you've got bass drum hammering away four on the floor. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Uh, snare drum two and four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And the interesting bit, and perhaps the tricky bit, if you're getting started with your drumming in the first few months or maybe years of playing, to play at this speed, 142 beats per minute, is the offbeat hi hat. When we get started playing the drums, we play a lot of one and two and three and four and like straight eighth notes on the hi hat or quavers, or we play even one, two, three, four, just quarter notes or crotchets. Here we're playing offbeat eighth notes every and. So, one and two and three and Like I say, it depends where you're at with your drumming. That might be fine, that might be something you need to build up. If you're quite near the beginning, best way to do it by a million miles, as far as I'm concerned. I think sometimes people think you're not supposed to do this, or this is wrong, or like, if you're, this means that you're not talented, and I'm here to tell you that is absolutely nonsense. Everybody has to do this, or at least I have to do this with loads and loads of things that I learned, and I've been playing the drums for almost 30 years. What you do is you go one note at a time, and you let your hands and your feet and your brain see it. You're not allowed to say, I'm struggling with this, or this is hard, before you've done this at length. Uh, so you say the notes out loud. So bass drum on the one, hi-hat on the end, snare drum and bass drum, on the two, hi-hat, on the and, and then that's the first half of the bar, the second half is the same. So you've got one, and, two, and, three, and, four, and. So you might say, you might say this is a classic disco pattern, right? That's the basic idea. It'll take some building up if that's new, but it's totally cool. Brilliant little bit of coordination. Can't repeat enough times. This isn't talent. This isn't some mysterious skill that you don't have and other people do. You build it, you craft it, you earn it. Go slow, show your hands and your feet, the right notes in the right order, and it will come together. Uh, there's one other section of the song uh, where the groove changes, standing in the dark. That goes to a single stroke roll, 16th note feel on the hi-hat. with the bass drum again playing four on the floor, or four quarter notes. That's that. Uh, when the song is played live, John Keeble, the, the drummer, he plays some open close hi-hats here and there, and he also, well, on the original, on the recorded version, there's some nice little overdub, like uh, Tom hits as well, and little rolls and stuff, and uh, he plays a little bit of that here and there, around there as well, so. That kind of business, but the core grooves. And. You can get those two down at 142 beats per minute, you're in business. I've done a whole other video about variations, getting variations going on offbeat hi-hat grooves. I'll link to that below. Uh, shout out to Good John and thanks for watching as always. Really appreciate it. Please like, share and subscribe. Uh, if you do subscribe and you, and you want to get a notification every time I upload a video, which is almost every day, please click the little bell icon. And like I say, shout out to Good John and all the amazing channel members who support this channel. If you've enjoyed these videos, found them useful or helpful, feel positive about them and you'd like to support this channel and you feel like you're in a position to, please consider doing so. You can do that via my Buy Me A Coffee support page. 
linked above or below or in my bio, depending where you're watching this, it'll say buy me a coffee slash become a channel member here. You can either buy me a coffee, a virtual coffee to support this channel, thanks a million to all the lovely people who do that, or you can become a channel member like you, John for £10 a month to get a whole load of great features in return for supporting this channel, becoming an integral part of it and helping it grow, which I massively appreciate. You get a customised, personalised practice plan uh, based on where you're at and where you want to go with your drumming updated for you as many times as you like as you progress. You get feedback on your drumming, you get a complimentary Zoom or face-to-face -face session in the first place where we work out at, you know, where you're at and try and formulate the best uh, plan for you based on uh, well, where I'm, my experience and what I think will work for you. And then uh, from there, uh, man, if you want to check in for future sessions, you can do that as well. A whole lot of other things, you get the notation and the practice along versions for videos such as this, that, that'll be over on the channel members page for this, uh, these two grooves uh, shortly. And then a whole lot of other things like ongoing drum support. If you message me anytime, I'll reply with your questions. You request future videos on the channel, like good John has done here, and loads of other stuff as well to help and support you as you develop on the drums. If, if you feel that would be useful, link above or below. And thanks for watching as always, really appreciate it, cheers. <laughs>